In Edmonton, 20% of energy use uh, comes from uh, residential buildings uh, and contributes to about 20% of the greenhouse gases that our city collectively admits, ad emits. So this evaluation label will help uh, homeowners make their uh, houses more efficient, be able to tell uh, future buyers, prospective buyers, about uh, the full cost of the home that they're about to purchase um, by factoring in the utilities. And I think that's a, an important bit of disclosure, an important bit of knowledge that we can use to help achieve our overall goals of reducing our greenhouse gases by 35% um, below the 2005 levels by 2035. The way a fuel efficiency sticker on a car will drive a decision or a nutritional label on, on food will tell you the calorie count. The Energy label also uh, creates an informed consumer and empowers that consumer to make decisions around energy efficiency. We have a newer home. We did some energy efficient um, upgrades. So we did solar panels, in-floor heating. So we were kind of always wondering what sort of rating we would get. So when they had offered the program, we put our name in. So yeah, it'll be interesting and we're excited to get the results. Like my husband works oil and gas, so it is good that in other parts we are a bit more energy efficient. I drive a Prius, he drives a big gas guzzling truck, so we try to balance it out. Even though I may have, like, I may have done like over 2,000 of these, every single little house is interesting and in every house I'll find something interesting. I'll find maybe a problem they never knew about. They lived, they've been living with this problem for years and they don't even know about it. Or just the astronomical air leakage that they've just been wasting through uh, all the cracks in the holes or missing insulation in the walls. So, so the energy odds are definitely more interesting, plus I get to meet all kinds of interesting people at the same time.